EnviroVent 2 installation. If you purchase an EnviroVent 2 with your kiln, you will want to install it before you do your test firing. If your kiln was not pre-drilled in the factory, the first step is to drill the proper vent holes. To determine the correct number, size, and location of the holes, consult the diagrams and charts on page 6 of your EnviroVent 2 manual. For your convenience, your kit includes both wood mounting screws and molly bolts for mounting to drywall. Whenever possible, try to mount at least two of the holes with wood screws into a wall stud. Once you have located the correct position, use a 3 inch hole saw to drill a hole in the wall. Slide the exiting duct through the wall and secure the motor with the screws included with your kit. The duct included with your kit can be stretched to a maximum length of 8 feet. Go ahead and stretch it to the estimated length you think you will need. Attach one end of the duct to the plenum cup using one of the two 4 inch hose clamps included with your kit. Check to make sure it's secure. Shape the duct into the desired routing position and use the second 4 inch hose clamp to mount it to the fan motor. Place the spring over the stand and then compress the plenum cup over the stand. Slide the compressed cup assembly underneath the kiln lining it up directly under the holes drilled in the bottom slab, and release the cup. Make sure the cup assembly is straight up and down, and not cocked at an angle. Check to make sure that the vent is operating correctly by turning on the inline switch and seeing if it draws a flame through one of the holes drilled in the lid. Place the vent sticker on the front of the control box underneath the operating instructions. Your Envar vent too may also be floor mounted by using the floor mounting adapter plate included with your kit. Position the motor on the plate as shown and attach using the hardware included with your kit. We recommend installing a screened vent cap to prevent rodents and insects from getting into the vent.